Hello and welcome to this episode of the Booth Review. Tonight, driving etiquette. Alright guys, what is the number one rule about driving? Always go fast. <laughs> True, I believe speed limits, sh they don't even, ex they shouldn't no. exist. You can mm -hmm. safely go 15 miles an hour over the if speed limit. If you're comfortable limit. going fast, yeah. you're not going to crash. Yeah. You know what's my biggest pet peeve about driving? When there's two turn lanes, and the person on the inside turn lane goes to an outside lane. Ooh, Stay in your lane. Stay in your lane. I hate those people. Or that happens all here. the time. I've almost died so many times from people just going into the other lane. I, I have to disagree. You're no, you're wrong. If they use their blinker to turn right while they're turning left, that's <laughs> while the they're per turning left. Perfectly legal. <laughs> they're to use turning blinker. Yeah, inside lane. That's blinker. what your blinker is used for. If okay, if there's two blinker lanes, to if turn. there's two lanes to go into, and there's two lanes here. Hey, if they're and using we're their both blinker, turning, being safe. How can they go straight into that lane? Where am I supposed to go? Are you saying right. if they use their you right blinker down. while going left, that's completely safe? No, you gotta, you gotta be defensive driver. Second of all, how am I supposed driver. to see their blinker if I'm going around them? You gotta be a defensive driver. Always be aware of your surroundings. If they're using their blinker to turn right into your lane while they're turning left, you gotta be aware. You gotta be aware. If you try that on me, I'm running your car into the wall. <laughs> so when you're a passenger, I think the passenger should control the radio because the driver shouldn't be doing anything but driving. I think that's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. That when you're driving, but I don't. When I'm driving, driving, it's my car, my radio. You don't touch my radio. If how you touch my radio in your car, you're likely to lose if your If you head. don't want me to smash into the back of the bus <laughs> and just destroy the passenger side, you better not touch my radio. Mm -hmm. You can't mm -hmm. be fiddling with a radio while you're driving. That's not safe. If I want to drive the way I, I want to drive. I can't be fiddling with you fiddling with my radio. Yeah, I need to be in the zone. If I'm going 80 on a 45, I need to be in the zone. I need to have my music going. Another thing I really hate is when you're driving down the freeway or driving at a pretty good speed and you're right behind someone and they put on their windshield wiper fluid and it just yeah. sprays back and gets all over Oh, your car. man. Oh. Especially if you just washed your car. You it's don't do that, man. everywhere. Wait, don't wait, wait, wait. What about bumper stickers? Bumper stickers? What about them? You don't need like, those. Why do you have so many? I like bumper stickers. I got a Monster Gatorade. Monster and Gatorade. Monster I got a Four Loco one. Why? You <laughs> look like a hippie. You got a Four Loco <laughs> no, and the, a Jesus it's Fish. It's not on the 1960s. Yeah. I got advertised for what I like. We don't need to see we'll save the whales. Like. No one cares about the whales. All right, guys. We talked a lot about driving. Now it's time to give our booths. I give driving etiquette five out of five booths because I like going fast and I like representing what I like. I'm gonna give driving five booths because I love to drive. It's the greatest feeling in the world. But I'm gonna give other people driving one boot because I'm a better driver than all of them. Of course. I give driving etiquette a three boot because I'm scared to start driving with the, these guys on the road. All right, I'm gonna give driving four boots out of five boots just because I also love uh, going fast, you know, driving down the road. You know, I'm in control of everything. But other drivers, uh, they can be real dangerous, so I'm gonna dock it down a booth. All right, so that does it about driving etiquette. Uh, thanks for tuning in. Make sure you come to the next episode.